uh, on my computer. Yeah. And it's boom, man, it scared the hell out of me. <laughs> you know, oh, smoke and everything coming out. <laughs> I said, oh, Lord. <laughs> Did it shake the, house, the building at all? Or no, just, well, just, just, just a little bit, yeah. you know, but it was kind of frightening, you know, because we don't expect that to happen to our seniors up this way. But it was very scary, man. Uh, how, many, how many did you hear? How many explosions? Two. The second one was about 520. Five, about 520. And, and the, I was, first, that, the first one was at? About 5 o'clock. Yeah. It really looked like that. Like, boom! <laughs> Yeah, he was over here 10 feet away. Charlie was. You want to talk to me? Charlie. Come here, Charlie. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay. What's your name, first of all? Charles. Last name? Benavides. Could you spell that for me? B-E-N-A-V-I-D-E-Z. Okay. Uh, what did you see? I was coming down from the store, and uh, I saw a lot of smoke, and I, I thought it was a car on fire. Then I looked by, and I heard a big boom. And I said, whoa, that's not a car on fire. And then uh, I started walking faster, and I heard another big boom. And then the cop says, get the hell out of there. I said, I'm on my way, brother. <laughs> and that's all I saw. And uh, then I went upstairs and kicked my pants off. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what did they, uh, so have they told you anything else? Uh, no. Uh, is your power out in the building? The power is completely on. OK. But thank God I've got a big ice chest and my, saved my freezer. <laughs> OK. And uh, so again, how close were you to the, first, the explosion? Oh, they? about from here to that pole. Yeah. And I heard the. A big steel thing coming up. I thought it was a car on fire, yeah. and it wasn't. It was a manhole. How would you describe your feelings or your thoughts as, as, when you realized what was going on? Well, my heart started pounding a little bit, and I started walking faster, and I heard another one. And then the cop tells me to get the hell out of there. I said, "What do you think I'm trying to do, man?" <laughs> and that was all. I just and then I got down the corner. I heard another, the big bang, yeah. and that's all. Okay, are you ready to be without power for a couple of days? Well, I, yeah, I've got a big ice chest. A lot of these people don't, though, so... But I, I'm okay. I'll be okay. Just uh, take a Navy shower on the ice chest. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. What's this going to be? Like? Is this... Uh, uh, the news. What happened? Up in my apartment on the 11th floor. And it scared me half to death. What I mean, went through your mind when you heard it? I thought it was the end of the world. Yeah? Yes, so they need to do something about that. Did you come down the elevator, or how did you get down to the floor, bottom floor? They have one elevator working right now, yeah. and you tell them all I'm praying for all of these people here, because this is a, a high rise for uh, seniors, you yeah. know, and, and this is scary. Uh, I'm hoping that they do something about that. Yeah. Yeah, because we can't live like that, you know. Okay, and your name? My name is Miss Barbara Hawkins. Barbara J. Hawkins. Hawkins, H-A-W-K-I-N-S? K-I-N-S, yes, okay. sir. thank you, Barbara. Take care. Uh -huh.
going or do they tell you to go? I'm just bringing my grandma to somewhere safer. Okay. We have lights. Thank you.